Hello viewers, greetings from BB Lectures. Uh, today uh, I am going to discuss about mail merging with Microsoft Excel and uh, Word. Uh, and I will uh, use the version Microsoft Excel or Word 2010. Uh, basically, mail merge is used to create multiple documents at once. And these uh, documents have uh, identical layout, formatting, text, and graphics. Um, only a specific section of each document varies is personalized. Uh, at first, the uh, documents Word can create uh, with mail merge, including bulk labels, letters, envelopes. Uh, I'm going to show you everything in detail. As you can see, that uh, I already created uh, three files, and uh, I'm going to show you the this to file I already opened this file uh, you can see that uh, employee ID full name SSN department start date earning and remarks this is the list of 50 employees so 50 employees information and uh, I want to create a form individual employee profile with the help of, of that list so to create 50 uh, employees individual profile and with the given information of Excel we can easily do it with mail merging at first you have to uh, I created this form uh, you can use any form you like and uh, in any place you can import the information from Excel at first you have to click on mailing then select start step by step mail merge wizard then you have to choose letter uh, I'm going to uh, I want to do it with the letters that's why my document is letter that I'm choosing letter next next use the current document I want to use this document that's why I'm selecting this next use an existing file already I have created a file that's why I'm choosing this option Next, I have to select the location where is the file desktop mailing merge. Here, what is uh, showing me the sheet? There has already three sheets, and I uh, inputted my information on first sheet, that's why I'm choosing the sheet one. After choosing one, Excel uh, uh, Word showing me the this information from Excel, and I would like to input all of our information. That's why I am selecting everything. everything. Okay. So already I have done the task. Now next step are very easy. You have to just insert the March field this way insert March field employee ID also you can do it with the preview result like in this SSN department start date So already I have indicated the field, all fields. You can insert field on your demand, which you want to show here. I'm going to finish this. 
edit individual documents if i click here then 50 uh, 50 pages will be created or as well as form will be created all okay now just wait what is importing all information and creating the, the uh, individual employee profile you can see that how word created 50 employee profile here with the help of mail merge employee id 1235 1236 glitch 1236 so the process is very easy you can uh, implement or you can use this mail merge in your business or for personal purposes i hope you will uh, i hope you enjoyed the video um, thank you